This is the most underrated drumline show of all time. And somehow they got last place almost, just a few tenths above. And also, welcome to the first video in the new office. It's so new that I haven't decorated it whatsoever. If this video gets 100 likes, I'll hang something on the wall right here-ish. Okay, let's check out this show now. And uh, the first thing I'm thinking is Squid Game. But this show came out like 13 years before Squid Game, so clearly Squid Game copied this. Performing the 2009 program, Videotape. Is the ensemble ready? Timber Creek Independent, you may enter the floor in finals competition. 14th place somehow. You're about to see how cool this is. Always watching. Hmm. Nice opening statement. A lot of notes in there. 71% of Americans welcome more video surveillance. But, but there's like a lot of shows that have been done like this, like recently. But remember, this is 2009, all right? Not everyone had smartphones at this time. I'm pretty sure those uh, Squid Game looking people were actually filming with those gigantic cameras. Oh yeah, we got any Radiohead fans up in here? Ooh -hoo! Yo, let's go! Ridiculously clean. All right, very tasty there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this whole show was just a, a bunch of Radiohead songs. Some good stuff. Yo, these snares are killing it. I'm just realizing the uh, the floor is like that sensor symbol. Hmm. All right, I hear you there, xylophones and marimbas. Ah, oh, almost there on the split. <laughs> Some sweeps and the tenors. Ooh, like a sando. <laughs> what, what sticks are the bass drums using? They're not mallets. Interesting. This is just a ram of notes. This whole show, very in your face. Yeah. Oh! Bro. Dude, the snares are absolutely killing it. I mean, everyone's killing it so far, but especially the snares. Like, these really fast triplet rolls. That ending section especially. All these isolated hits in the front ensemble lined up perfectly. 14th place beats right there. Okay, so I believe we had a snare feature, and then a tenor feature, and then there was another snare feature at the end. And like I do in all these reaction videos, I'm gonna play, or at least attempt to play, all of the features that happen.
Alright, we're back. Uh, I think we're going into the ballad. We're about at that point. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Called it. <laughs> you were caught on video tape an average of 200 times a day. 1,400 times a week. 122,800 mm. times a year. That's a lot. In your home office. Home. Yep, you guys are all watching me. It's creepy. Knock it off. Yeah, I think at this point, uh, when I saw the show for the first time, I hadn't heard this song, uh, this Radiohead song, videotape, and uh, I've loved it ever since. It's a cool song. The vocalist is doing a great job. Yeah, if the show was done uh, nowadays, I bet they would sample all those vocals. Highlighting the snares again. Oh, we got some f split flam taps. Oh, he's got electronic drums. Interesting. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Oh, another snare feature. Oh, look at all those all sorts of tricks going on. Yeah. Oh, rim shots. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, and the one-handed roll. That was some next level stuff right there. Such cool visuals, and it was very, very clean. But there's only one little, a couple of diddles got crushed somewhere in there. Yeah, there's a little tiny bit of fuzz there, but overall very good, definitely very demanding. Yeah, you never really see snare lines playing uh, these visual kind of solos, like not to this extent. This is kind of like an I and E solo written for a line. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's go play it. Okay, closing movement coming up. Yo, what kind of mallets are the bass drums using? It just looks like they're using snare drum sticks, but it can't be. It can't be. Oh. Yes. <laughs> nice. A lot of really loud, over-the-head, isolated attacks that were quite good. Oh, squid Game guys right up in his face. Oh, oh, we got a bunch of Squid Game guys now. Ladies and gentlemen, from Orlando, yes. Florida, Timber Creek Independence!
Yeah, I always like the uh, darker kind of creepy shows, and this had quite a lot of creepiness to it. Always watching. The ironic thing is <laughs> that there was definitely a lot of cameras uh, filming this. Uh, we're, we're watching all the angles <laughs> as they're being filmed. So, uh, checking out the scores here, we got Timber Creek way down at the bottom in 14th place. Unfortunately, they don't uh, keep the recaps of the historical scores, only the final score, so we can't know for sure if like one judge tanked them or all the judges just didn't like the show for some reason. But I know that I liked it, alright? This show definitely stood out, even, what, 14 years later? I, I still uh, go back and watch the show every now and then. It's a really good one. Speaking of really good shows, this is a good one right here. You should totally check that one out next. And have a good morning.